Hello. Hello, welcome to Atlantis Camper. We are here today at the Dusseldorf uh, uh, Caravan Salon 2024 and we are introducing our new range of products uh, all in uh, monocoque on alco chassis and double floor. This year in particular we present the first prototype of uh, a motorhome fully built uh, on uh, carbon fiber. This is what I saw and I was so impressed. Fully built. Yes, uh, it is all one block, so there are no joints between the walls and the sides. So it, it will never have uh, any uh, chains to let the water go inside. Yeah, and uh, another good advantage is that it is extremely rigid, so it's much safer when you drive in, even in case of accident. It does not uh, uh, let the, the walls uh, break. And moreover, it's a lot easier to, to repair when you, when you have a, a, a layer like this of, uh, of uh, fiberglass, or in this case of, or, of carbon. Perfect. Let me show you the inside, because okay. also the inside is uh, quite, uh, quite new. In this solution, we have uh, a wide uh, dinette uh, with uh, a swing bed on top. Okay. You can come on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> There is this uh, electric movement uh, uh, for, the, for, the, for the swing bed, so you can have your bed always ready. And when it's time to go to bed, you just push the button and the, the bed uh, comes down. And this allows us to, have, uh, to, to generate a lot of space inside so that uh, is not, uh, would not otherwise not be used during, uh, during the day. You hide all the mess. Yes, exactly. So nobody can see. You leave uh, the, the, the bed always, yes. uh, always <laughs> done uh, and uh, when it's time uh, to go to bed you just uh, pull it down. Very nice. And uh, also we leave uh, a lot of space in the back for a wide bathroom with a separate shower in this the inside. This is what I like. Whenever the bathroom is in the back of the camper, we have a big space yes. always. You leave a big space here for uh, the um, for the shower, as well as uh, a huge. It looks really, really good of good quality. As well as understand. a huge exactly, there is a huge wardrobe inside. Oh yes. With all the drawers, so even if somebody needs to use this um, motorhome for uh, long journeys, mm -hmm. you can uh, store here a lot of uh, a lot of stuff, a lot of clothes, gear. Um, a really big space here. Yes, exactly. And underneath you can always have uh, access to the full mm -hmm. garage which is inside. Uh, From this side? Yes, which is free and it can uh, host uh, even a couple of bicycles or... Yes. Or a small motorcycle. Small motorcycles, definitely. All of this is uh, free and always accessible from the inside. Mm -hmm. And uh, you also have a, a wide uh, bathroom that you, can, uh, that you can use with the advantage of keeping well separated the living area from of shower course. and bathroom. Of so course. that way when you close this door you generate two completely closed uh, environments, two completely closed areas so one person can be inside taking a shower, getting changed and the other can uh, use uh, the entire living area without uh, having any any difficulties. It's really nice and I love it because whenever you are in toilet or in shower you need to have space. Exactly. You don't want to suffocate, have the, have the door the walls, uh, exactly. your face. This is what I love. <laughs> exactly. And then when, it, the, the, when it's time to go to bed you just put down the bed, you have your television here ready mm -hmm. so you can uh, enjoy you know, the television and the big uh, living area. Yes, and also the living area is uh, really big. This can also turn into a Exactly, bed. This, in case of need, it can turn into a third bed. We just have to so easy. push it down. Yes, and you use the mm -hmm. pillows to complete the bed. Understand, yes. Yes, and you make one, yes. one, uh, one uh, uh, single bed of uh, 1 meter 90. Of, uh, of length, so it's, uh, really it's nice. quite comfortable, plus two uh, seats for, uh, uh, for uh, when it's time to go driving. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
The keychain is quite big as well. I mean, uh, for a compact car, it's uh, <coughs> quite big with the fridge, the drawers and the cooking... Stoves? Yes, yeah, stoves. Okay, the cabin on top. Exactly. It's really good. Spacious. You, ha you have space to do everything. Exactly. And for the heating system, we have uh, mm -hmm. Truma. So it is a diesel electric uh, uh, Combi 4 mm -hmm. for this uh, uh, for this motorhome and uh, Combi 6 for for the bigger the bigger models, mm -hmm. which allows you to uh, use the gasoline, um, the diesel uh, fuel to uh, heat up uh, the water and uh, to heat uh, to, to generate the hot air, mm -hmm. which all uh, leaves under the fourth floor, so in the in the double floor, I mean, and that uh, heats up uh, the the floor itself because the, the tubes of the of the Truma and the um, heating system they pass all underneath the floor and they heat the the floor, which is uh, uh, like having a, a heated floor, but you don't use any electricity to to heat it up, just simply the the heating system itself. Perfect. Perfect. An extra cabin here. Yes, here normally we put uh, all the uh, uh, fuse, fuse, uh, the, the, the fuse, the electrical components. Ah, uh, yes, uh, no, that's the, yes, technical, <laughs> yes, yes okay. uh, of the system, and uh, it, they they all go inside here. I like it because it's bright in here. Yes. I made a video before with another camper, and I mentioned it. I like it because when I enter inside. It's so bright, so it gives you a feeling of joy and um, uh, I don't know how to express it. A really nice feeling. Makes you a little bit feel like home. Yes, it's, uh, yes, it's more really nice. Visible. It's really warm. This is one of the colors that we uh, in, like the most. In fact, we gave it as a, an option for the standard color, but actually our clients can choose from a wide range of uh, ah, different materials and colors. For everything actually, because uh, for Atlantis Camper makes uh, uh, custom layouts, so we make uh, the plant, the, the layout of the furniture uh, that can be chosen by the end customer, so together with our interior designer we decide what's the best layout for, uh, for the customer's needs. Plus, we allow to uh, choose uh, all the different materials for the seats, for the wood, for the, all the furniture. They can choose if they want HPL, like in this case for the um, cooking. Um, we can, we allow to choose basically all the materials and colors. So that way you really feel your motorhome like if it was your second uh, little house. Yes, yes, you can make it custom. Exactly. It's really nice. So let's check also the outside. What From the outside think? we have uh, you can notice the um, tent, which is integrated in the monocoque, which oh, is quite okay. unique. And this is allowed, us, allowed uh, this is due to the fact that we have the, the monocoque uh, that is uh, entirely made in our production plant. Mm -hmm. So in the moldings, we have uh, kept, kept the space to put inside the, the tent and uh, the, the owning, I mean. And uh, <clears throat> this is much safer also when you when you drive when you when you travel so that you don't hit against it and it is a lot more aerodynamic so you won't hear any any noise uh, given given from it. All the doors are have a, an electric uh, closure um, system of uh, closures which is um, which goes very easy with these uh, buttons. Uh, it has a smart key. Exactly, a smart key, yeah, smart key. Smart key. So with uh, one button, you can choose uh, uh, to close the entire motor rooms, all the doors. And uh, with a different button, you can choose to close the... the okay, the... so you don't have to search for your, for your keys to open uh, exactly. uh, the cabin. And in case you uh, ran out of battery, no problem, because mm -hmm. from the inside, you can always uh, open uh, all the doors like uh, all the doors of the, of the motorhome they have a, a mechanism that can be opened from the from the inside okay. in case of a uh, lack of uh, electricity power also i see strong but yes very strong hinges uh, yes. which are have been patented by atlantis mm -hmm. uh, the, they're very uh, st uh, strong and they 
close in a very small space. Mm -hmm. So that way the, the, the housing we need to make for the hinge is very limited and we can uh, uh, have a very compact design even in, the, in, uh, in, this, uh, in this feature. So easy. <laughs> So easy and uh, so lightweight because even the door has been made of carbon, so it's all really lightweight. Uh, in general, in all our products, we never use uh, plastics uh, components, uh, so we make everything in uh, fiberglass or carbon fiber. Oh, really nice. I see also the main door. It yes. The same system. Exactly. Ah, the door has cool. the, the same <laughs> system, so Thank it's so super much. safe. <laughs> The handle was also made of carbon and when you open this is really cool. <laughs> <laughs> super strong with with the blinders and the, and, the, um, and everything <laughs> The strong, uh, the, the the strength. I mean, of the of these uh, mm, motor rooms is given really from the monocoque uh, structure. In this case, uh, has been made by using a layer of carbon together with the expanded PVC carbon again, and then we finish it with a gel coat, uh, a white gel coat. Mm -hmm. So this uh, allows to be not only very um, lightweight but also extremely rigid mm -hmm. and at the same time it gives an excellent um, isolation and coibentation from the outer temperature so you can use your uh, motor home even with a very cold uh, weather there is no problem because it's really well isolated so between uh, this structure of the of the body plus the double floor it uh, it really isolates very well the inside and typically our clients in the they tell us that when they are uh, at their camping spot they have like three or four degrees more inside the the inside the motorhome when it's winter when it's even really cold moreover we have certified the performance of uh, the temperature of the motorhome by uh, use by um, uh, doing a test in climate in the climate chamber of Truma who has brought down the temperature to minus 15 degrees oh. with minus 15 degrees we left the motorhome uh, uh, there for uh, for the night and then we turned on the heater with the heater on it uh, reached the, the temperature of 20 degrees in only three hours oh, so, so Exactly. Imagine that you left your motor home outside in winter. You go inside and in three hours you have already 20 degrees. In four hours we had the 26 degrees inside, meaning that we had uh, like more than 20, 35 degrees, 36 degrees more uh, inside than it was what it was outside, Amazing. which is super. Yes. Yes. Super, yes. yes. Amazing. Let's go check it also around and around. Sure. You can see here the big opening, the big window, the sky view, yeah. which is always, which lets the light to go inside, uh, even when the bedroom is up or down. So it's always, uh, it always lets a lot of uh, light to go in, and as well it lets you see the night sky, for example, ah, when you are sleeping really. in the bed. Here we have the drawer, which is also electric. And lets you some, yes, it lets you some uh, space where you can put uh, stuff inside, mm -hmm. and Maybe it is shoes. yes, shoes or uh, um, whatever you may need for uh, for camping, and uh, this is this is uh, um, possible thanks to the double floor that we have, so we can um, we can even give some space used, useful for uh, for storage. Over there on top you can see some uh, uh, carbon uh, uh, components, so? yes, okay. those are made to let the water drain out, oh. that way the water doesn't uh, remain on the, on the top of the, 
of the car. I got it. And here you can see still some uh, carbon uh, uh, components made uh, uh, on the on the bottom of the of the body. Yes, to be more, more, more beautiful. Uh, it is a really nice camper. Uh, thank you very much for the presentation. Thank you for making this video, for following the whole uh, camper tour. Yes. This is Atlantis Camper and this was the Carbon 595 here at the Dusseldorf Trade Fair. Okay, thank you very much. I'm thank going you. to show also sure. uh, the technical uh, characteristics.